Okay, everybody, here we are at the final airport of our trifecta. And we're going to go take a look at some night lights and just see how smooth she's going to be. New York and L.A. have proven to be uh, an outstanding improvement compared to what I've had before. And this is the last of the big hitting areas in the States. Uh, in Chicago. So we're going to go see what this looks like now. Uh, I'm expecting it to be absolutely stunning. Hopefully I'm not going to be wrong. We're going to come out here make a hard right and get a good look at these buildings. Positive rate. They stay nice and low here. Oh, look at that. 400. Butter smooth. Look Bank at those park cars down angle. there. Bank angle. Outstanding. 1,000. Like butter. Yeah. Oh, that is absolutely stunning. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at the Chicago skyline. We'll work our way over there, swing around. I would even think that some of the uh, critics would have to say that this is better than what it was. By far. You may not have a 3090 board in your computer, or you're not running the i9-10900 CPU, but every computer system is different. And granted, it did take me, you know, a long time going through all these settings to try and find what was right. But if I can find it for my setup, I'm sure you can find it for yours as well, if this doesn't work for you. But right now, I am, man, and I feel like that kid uh, on that Willy Wonka movie that just opened up a chocolate bar and found a golden wrapper. I have found the golden settings for my setup. And for those of you that got a 3090 board and some i9, 10900s, maybe this will work for you. And who knows, you got some better equipment, you've been having issues. Maybe these settings will do it for you as well. So I hope so. I hope you find it useful. Me? This is just making flights in that much more enjoyable. I've never seen it like this. This is absolutely beautiful. It makes me really afraid to even think about update to the next beta. <laughs> it's that good. Alright, so we'll swing out over the water. We'll get a good look at the uh, skyline here in Chicago. the other room crying. My wife just went to the store. I think he's got separation anxiety issues. Oh, that looks fantastic. Look at that view. Beautiful. And I didn't have to turn down my settings to get this because I'll tell you, when I first started doing this, that's what I did. Tried turning down settings, turning down settings, turning down settings. And it didn't get any better. So, it got to the point where I, I had an idea that that was definitely not the issue. So, for everybody out there saying turn it down, and you've got some decent equipment, uh -uh. don't do it. Go and figure it out. Spend some time in the NVIDIA control panel, because the answer lies in there. It did for me, and I'm sure it will for you. For those of you that are fortunate enough to have some good equipment, you may be able to just plug and play these in. If you do, great, man. I hope you find them useful. Okay, this is looking real nice. I'm not seeing any showstoppers here as well. Looks like butter. And uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this video together. Put together my NVIDIA settings and my uh, X-Plane uh, settings to show you what I've got and how I've achieved this. And again, I hope you can find it useful. Alright, everybody. Take care, and I'll catch you on my next run. Oh, and by the way, the link for these vehicles, if I haven't said it before, 
is down below for the park cars, as well as my uh, night lighting edit. Alright everybody, I'll catch you in those friendly skies. Those stutter-free skies now. Well, for the most part. Alright everybody.